as you break tackles and increase those gains. They'll try the air now with Smith. No chance to get away. Yo, I want to welcome all y'all to the best Madden 19 tips and trips channel where you will be able to dominate on offense, send the fast blitzes on defense, make your opponent rage quit and send you nasty messages or either beg for you to quit out the game. I also do custom schemes if you play regs, so hit your boy up, follow the link in the description to get all the ebooks and you will become an exclusive member. Welcome to the Clamp Squad. What's up gamers, welcome to another Madden 19 tip video. Today we're going to go over the Mike Sam Crash Press out of the 4-3 under. And I'm going to walk y'all through a few key adjustments other than how to just set the play up. I want y'all to be able to dominate when y'all using these. Now if you want full schemes, the link in the description has all the ebooks. If you have the offense and the defensive ebook, you become an exclusive member. Also, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Let's go for 50 likes on this video and I will keep bringing y'all the fire post patch tips. So we like to flip the play. When I come out, I base a line. I base a line, show blitz, and then I like to crash toward the blitz and angle. That's only if you're not hovering and holding a certain button. Now, if you are hovering and you want them to come in real fast and take away from the offensive lineman's AI, then you want to base a line, show blitz, and crash away from the blitz and angle. So we're going to flip the play, we're going to base a line, we're going to show blitz. That's the first key setup. Now, we're going to we're going to Tampa one side of the field. This is going to help you out with coverage. And then we're going to play to the outside. We want to make sure that everything, all the wide receivers have to come back to the middle of the field where your user is at. So you want to base a line. You want to show blitz. That's the first two things that you want to do. Then you want to crash your line either toward the blitz angle or away from the blitz angle. And then you want to bluff blitz your user. And then come stand right in between the center and the right guard. Now, if you want them to come in fast, like your defensive end on that right side, once you stand in the middle, like I am doing right now in this slow-mo, you want to hold the L1 or the LB, depending on what system you on. So when you bluff blitz, he will take a couple steps forward. Right now, I'm just holding right trigger, so I'm able to stay there, strafe, and then take off running. If you hold L1 or LB on the bluff blitz, he would take one or two steps forward and then you control and take off running down the field. So we're going to base a line, show blitz, crash line either toward the blitz and angle or away from the blitz and angle. And then we're going to bluff blitz and we're going to bring them down close to the box right here. And I'm going to hold the L1 or the LB button. Now we put the tampa on the right side and that's behind the scenes coverage. He won't know what you're doing and you can see how fast the end comes off instead of waiting for that loop and blitz. Last time we hit 70 some likes. Let's go for 50 likes on this video. I will keep digging in my bag of tricks and bringing y'all some post patch tips. Like I said, base a line, show blitz, crash your defensive line either toward the blitz angle or you can just crash them out. I like to crash them toward the blitz angle. Bluff blitz your user and it's all set up. You can make adjustments behind it by tamping both sides, tamping one side, cross man and man the people up. It's all up to you. If you need help with a scheme, the link is in the description. I got y'all. Let's go.